Okay, so um, that little one's not doing so well. Um, I just let it over to a drink. I'm going to get a capful of water with some honey for it. Uh, uh, if it died, I wouldn't be surprised. Look, I, I've got to just let, let nature take its course. I've cleaned all this out. I have not put nearly as much um, chalk in, and I've put a clean chucks, like a, a wipe underneath, put some Scots towels over under, because clearly it's getting very humid, and um, this got knocked over before, but I've taken the older chicks out. So these chicks are like maximum a week old, down to zero days. And then I've left this in here. I mean, I've got to can put a clean paper towel. I might actually take that out. I, I just don't know what to do with this one. I might put this one back in there with another one. But I just want to see. I put it up against. It's really hard to film. And come and see if you can have a drink, darling. I know. I think it's deformed. I'm not sure. Here, here, there you go. Hi, there, sweetie. Leave, leave that one alone. Good baby. Can you have a drink? Can you have a drink? Keeps focusing off. Hang on. Sorry. Yeah, let that baby drink. Let the baby drink. Stop it. I'll, I can get it another drink. That's perfect. I'll get a little cap. I, I normally feed my sick chicks, even though this is a guinea fowl, keep caps of water. Okay, baby. You want to get a drink? That gets cleaned two or three times a day, so that's just a bit of chaff. I just don't want him to get pushed around too much. See, I might even take some of these bigger sea brights out of here for the night. Yeah, I might do that. Let's, let's have a look at this situation here. 